that God's people should be dwelling together in unity. They should have their own land, have their own houses, and not be in debt to the governments and the, and the banks of this world. You don't see them teaching that, though. They only go so far. So I could easily just condemn them for the way that they're living in their lifestyle. Uh-oh. See, all mouths would be shut up and stopped in, wouldn't it? Huh? Oh, Lord. Oh, look at here. Look at here. See, so they, people ain't so wise, brothers and sisters. They ain't so wise at all. We supposed to be the head, not the tail. Ain't that right? Huh? But every time we, we, we taking our tail over to bow down to the world for something, every time you turn around. Amen. 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 And they call going out and getting in a blessing, getting in debt and stuff. They call that a blessing of God. Huh? I call that a lie. I say your pastor is a lie. And your teacher is a lie. Your elder, your evangelist, your mama, your daddy, whoever teach you that nonsense is a liar. Amen. How can I say that? I used to be bound by the same thing until I read the book and I believed it. So I understood the words that said, come out of her, my people. And unless you folk come out of that foolishness, you're going to stay the way you are. And be ye separate, saith the Lord. That only mean just move geographical locations, brothers. That mean come out of her in your mind, your way of thinking. Come out of her way in your heart. So that the Father can work with you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Well, see, I, I guess, well, I just stopped all dumb mouths then, didn't I? Amen. Again, they, you won't hear them preach that, though. They won't preach that. I promise they won't touch that with a thousand-foot pole. Uh, past this supposed to be a ten foot pole. I know what I said. A thousand foot pole. The reason why I said a thousand foot pole because they can't hold it. Much less a man today. He's so weak he can barely even hold a ten foot pole. Amen. <laughs> Read on, brother. Railings and evil summizings. Evil, so come on with it. Perverse disputings of men of corrupt minds. So when you see them out there blasting each other back and forth, brothers and sisters, this is perverse disputings of men of corrupt mind. They're all full of jealousy. They're all full of envy because they're all looking for place with one another. Amen. Israel is dispersed, scattered. And God has set up shepherds. That's why he said, I will give you pastors, not pastor. I will give you pastors, S, plural, according to my heart, which will feed you in knowledge and understanding. Everybody just had to be at different places, brothers and sisters. Hmm? But who are, who are thou to judge another man's servant? To his own master, he stand or he fall on him. All right, anyway, praise. read on, brother. And destitute of the truth. See, destitute of the truth. It seems like they have the truth, but they don't have it. The truth is Jesus. Amen. I want to hear about all these nonsense, these broken Hebrew people who try to say, well, his name wasn't Jesus. Wow. You got a revelation. I got a person that's sick over here. Come heal him and I can listen to you. You can't just shut up. Uh-oh. Mm. That's called a rubber meet the road. Proof in the pudding. Put up, shut up. Put up, shut up. <laughs> hmm? Amen. Pedal to the metal. Yeah. Yeah, amen. amen. That's what that's called. Anyway, read on, brother. Supposing that gain is godly. Because that, that's the prosperity doctrine right there. Sure. You know, the more you have, show how much favor you got with God. Amen. Hmm. That's something but the poor had a gospel preached on, though. Amen. That's right. Amen. Amen. Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of God. Amen. Amen. I miss something here. Yeah, no. mm. I miss something? No. Mm. Read on. From such withdraw myself. So if you people have any form of intelligence at all, you get away from all these jack legs who are fleecing the people of God. Amen. Hallelujah. So, you know, you'll get on YouTube and you'll see all this mess. You see all these people lay claim to, every last one of them lay claim to the most high. James 3.16, brother. Listen to this one. For where envying and strife is. So you get these people beckering and back and forth towards each other. For where envy and strife is, read on. There is confusion. There is what? Confusion. Confusion and what else? And every evil work. Every word. evil work. So that's why you don't see me getting up on it. I mean, I, if I'm going to deal with anybody, brother, sister, it's going to be face to face. I don't get this phone line. By the way, let me ask a question of everybody. Hmm? What does arguing reprove? I 
Good, I'll leave it at that. Mm -hmm. I'll leave it at Because of envy and jealousy and a lack of spiritual maturity, novices are lifted up with pride. What did Jesus say to his disciples? What did Jesus say to his disciples? When his disciples came to him about one casting out devils in his name. Mark 9, verse 38. Read, brother. And John answered him. Saying, what did John say? Master, we saw one casting out devils in thy name. Now, we can't say that today because ain't none of these folks out here doing it. Amen. Matter of fact, they don't even believe nobody can do it. That's true. They think it was done away with all the miracle signs and one of done away with the deposits. That's why they can run their mouth, though. Amen. See, so, you know, let's, let's just stick with this time. Because right. the devil's sitting right down the pew, right in front of them, and they don't even know it. More, most time he's in the pulpit. So they can't even say that. But anyway, so we saw one casting out devils in our name. So we can understand this because we cast out devils. We can understand it. We don't have no compunction. We just obey what God says, man. That's all there's to it, right? So we saw one casting out devils. And what did they say? And he followeth not us. Isn't that something? He's not associated with He's not a chartered member of the church of Jesus Christ house of prayer. Isn't that something? He's not associated with us, isn't it? We saw one casting out devils in thy name, and he is not, he ain't following us. Read on. And we forbade him. So we told him to shut up. Read on. Because he followed us. Because he don't follow us. What you think about that, King? Didn't we do good? Come and give me a pat on the back. Read on. But Jesus said. Jesus, let's see what the king said. Forbid him not. Man, are you out of your mind? Forbid him not. Read on. For there is no man which shall do a miracle in my name. Because we can't say it today because ain't too many people need doing a miracle. The miracle they have going on is their mouth running. Because their spirit and their footsteps is not lining up with the way that the New Testament church, New Covenant church should be running, isn't it? Right. But we're just going to assume this, okay? We just assume it, all right? Uh -huh. And he says right here that there is no man which can do a miracle in my name that what? That can lightly speak evil of. And there ain't nobody lightly speaking. Ain't nobody speaking evil of Christ, brothers and sisters. They're attacking each other. The king had already dealt with this idea, this notion. Read on. For he that is not against us is, is what? Is on our part. Is on our part. See, see so believe it or not, it's, see, the, the problem is, is that everybody is just at different levels of understanding. They don't need to go around and condemn. And then you sit out there and allow the name of Christ to be blasphemed amongst the heathen when they sit and watch all these zoos and circuses that they running. Yeah. Yeah. Satan has done a good job at throwing a hand grenade in the midst of the assembly and killing everybody through the mouths of these false preachers, false teachers, false brethren Amen. who have no understanding whatsoever at all. So I hope I was able to answer the question of the reason why I don't get into fights with people. I don't believe in verbal fighting. I believe in fist fighting. That's what I believe. I believe in the doctrine of laying on of hands. Nehemiah. Praise the Lord. Of course, then you know they'll judge me about that too, won't they? That, well, it makes no difference. They already judge me about everything else. It's always a big deal. Amen. Ain't no big deal. So Satan has entered into the minds of corrupt men who don't have any understanding of the enemy's devices. Satan has turned the church against each other and in this are putting great millstones. 